Happiness in marriage is not something that just happens. A good marriage must be created. In marriage, the little things are the big things. It is never being too old to hold hands. It is remembering to say I love you at least once a day. It is at no time taking the other for granted. The courtship should not end with the honeymoon. It should continue through the years. It is having a mutual sense of values and common objectives. It is standing together facing the world. It is forming a circle of love that gathers the whole family. It is speaking words of appreciation and demonstrating gratitude in thoughtful ways. There is no way you are going to get that long. <laughs> it is not looking for perfection in each other. It is cultivating flexibility, patience, understanding, and a sense of humour. <laughs> it is not only marrying the right partner, it is being the right partner. Alexander Osborne take thee, Bethany Alex Osborne, to be my wedded wife. I will cherish our friendship, love you today, tomorrow and forever. I will always be there. I, Bethany Alex Osborne, take thee, Lee Alexander Osborne, <laughs> Lee Alexander Osborne, I take thee, Bethany Alex Osborne, <laughs> to be my wedded husband. I will laugh with you and cry with you. I will love you for the best and the worst of a difficult and easy. Come what may, I will always be there. It's now my privilege and my very great pleasure to be able to tell you <laughs> you are now husband and wife. Many congratulations to you both. Good afternoon everyone. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ian. I'm Bethany's stepfather. And on behalf of my wife Catherine and myself, it's a great pleasure to welcome you all here today. Two, three. I want to thank you all for being here today. I know it means a lot to Bethany and Lee. To Lee, welcome to the family. <laughs> and take good care of Bethany. And also, good luck. Right, to Beth, me and your mother give you this message. We love you and are so proud of the woman you have become. And we hope that you and Lee have a wonderful, loving and happy life together. I'd really like to thank everybody for making it here today. It's not been easy getting here. It's not been easy getting everybody together. But you know, from the bottom of our hearts, thank you very much for joining us today. My amazing bride. Without her, quite obviously none of this would have been possible. She's battled COVID. She's abused Boris, yeah. She's, she's survived an assortment of lockdowns and deferrals and all sorts of things, but she has unquestionably 
worked so hard to create what we have today. I don't actually remember the first time I met Beth, but over the following few years, Beth and I have become great friends. Suffice to say that we were friends long before we got together, and as a result of that friendship, it was inevitable that we would fall in love at some point. <laughs> okay. I'm going to start with the toast. First of all, Lee and Beth. Yeah. Lee and Beth. Secondly, for the bloody day coming and us being here. How many times has it been cancelled? I'll tell you. I did my first speech. <laughs> Forget that. I did my second speech. Forget that. I left it till the last minute while I was on the toilet this morning and I thought, Bugger it, I'm going to do it tonight. <laughs> Only joking. I first met Lee when we were, well, I was about 10 years old and we were in the Scouts. So if you want to open envelope number one, <laughs> you'll see a ridiculous picture of Lee in the Scouts. 36 years I've known him, I have to say. In all the years I've known Lee, never seen him so happy. I'm going to tear up there, so sorry. <laughs> Beth, you are beautiful. You make him so happy. You really do. Open envelope from before, just a picture of me and Lee together many years ago. Over 36 years, he's been an absolute rock. Really? <laughs> so a happy couple and a fantastic day and a bit of normality. Beth and Lee, congratulations. So I would like to thank my best friend, my partner, and then my wife. I love you. This is 